and I are members of the space generation. You are the first people ever to have this perspective as part of your everyday world. Let's say the yellow thing is the sun. Then we have Venus. Too hot. Mars is too cold. <laughs> No other humans ever have been able to know this the way you know it. Now, as I said, Mars is too cold. 40 below at eye level. That's not good. It's hard to live there. Could be some Mars probes <coughs> squirting around. We don't know. Venus. Venus, my friends. I hope you all remember very well playing this game. I'm not sure I hope that you still play it, but... Okay. This is like the kitchen floor, and, and this part of the kitchen floor, you can stand on that. But all this, this is like, this is like lava. <laughs> and this, the, the frame around that, that's like acid. Okay? So you, you have to step like this, because otherwise you're going to burn up and die. <laughs> On Venus, it's really like that. Okay. On Venus, it's so hot. That's a little worried. On Venus, it's so hot that the acid rain, the sulfuric acid rain, doesn't even reach the ground. It evaporates before it reach the, reaches the ground because the ground is radiating so much heat. That is creepy, my friends. <laughs> that is, because, that's like hell. That's like hell. That's what we envision as hell. And nevertheless, this insight is still, I claim, a reflection of the joy of discovery. We can know this in a way that no one else has known this. And by the way, the reason Venus is so crazy hot is because of its atmosphere. Oh, it is closer to the sun by... Uh, 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 uh. But it's really that the atmosphere is so crazy thick. And, oh, this heat holds it in. <laughs> now, these next couple shots are probably pretty familiar to all of you, but let's review. Let's review. Uppsala Glacier, Argentina, 1928. Who could forget? <laughs> is well within my dad's lifetime. He was nine years old. My mom was five, I guess, at this time. And you can see this is what people call, in the business, call the ice sheet. And this is a word referring to the ice being like a sheet. It's an ice sheet. But if you go there now, as you all may know, this is a famous picture taken just a few years ago. There is no ice sheet. Now it's a lakey mud flat thing. <laughs> and this is a result of climate change. This is a result of this part of the world getting warmer. This is the kind of pictures, these are the kind of pictures that people show you to scare you. Ha 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 ha. 